Hey guys, I'm Esther from SE Cooks, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to make this delicious, creamy, thick, vegan ranch dip. This is amazing. So this is not a ranch salad dressing. This is definitely a dip that you can use for your vegetables. You can use it with chips, my personal favorite. Um, you can use it however you would like to use vegan ranch dip. Now this is super easy to make because it is vegan mayo based. So you don't have to worry about soaking cashews or anything like that. It comes together really fast and easy with some simple ingredients you probably have at home. And if you want to make this into a vegan ranch dressing, all you have to do is add a quarter cup of plant milk, plain plant milk to it to thin it out. So it actually can work as a dressing. You just need to thin it out with some plant milk. So let's get started. I'm gonna show you how to make one of my favorite dips of the summer, which is this ranch vegan dip. Okay, let's get started with a cup and a half of vegan mayo. Nice and creamy and easy, of course. If you're doing this with cashews, it takes a lot more effort and we just want something we can whip up on a hot summer's day and enjoy right away. Veggies, chips, whatever you like. Personally, I love this on potatoes. So we're gonna add a tablespoon or two of lemon juice. I'd recommend starting with one and seeing how you like that. And then I'm gonna add a tablespoon of either apple cider vinegar or white wine vinegar. I have white wine vinegar here, so I'm gonna add a tablespoon of that. Just eyeballing it a little bit there. And now I'm gonna start adding my spices. So I have garlic powder, I have onion powder, and I have dill. You can do parsley um, dried as well, but I just happen to have fresh parsley from my Nona's garden, so I'm gonna be using that. So for the garlic lovers, we're gonna start with one whole teaspoon of garlic powder. And a little bit less on the onion powder. If you want more, you can certainly add more, but I do about half a teaspoon of onion powder here. And then our dried dill, if you have fresh dill, highly recommend it. Anytime you have fresh, it's always better. I'm gonna do a whole teaspoon of don't mind the mess <laughs> of dried dill. You'd use about two to three tablespoons of fresh dill if you were gonna do that instead. And then I'm gonna add in my fresh chopped parsley and I need some chives. We'll get a couple of our fresh chives. Oh, that smells so good as you're cutting it. Just gave these a little rinse and we're ready to put them in. So you can put about Ooh, it was my hair. You can put about a quarter cup of fresh chives. If you don't have it, it's okay, but it definitely really adds to it. I'm just gonna chop those right in. Green onions would work as well, just dice them up really finely. All right. I'm just gonna add a little bit of salt and pepper to taste. I like lots of fresh ground black pepper personally, but you can do this to your own liking. Give that a little mix. Nice and creamy. This takes no time at all to mix up. You just give it a couple little mixes just to make sure all the ingredients are blended and then it is ready. This is the perfect thing for summer because it's just, it's so easy. It's the perfect dip. So now let's plate it up and give it a taste test. I just need a little bit of this for right now and this keeps for up to a week in the fridge. So I can just take what I need right now and use the rest later in the week, which is why I love making a big batch like this. If this is too much for you, you can just reduce the amount in half. It's, it's no problem that way. It is time for the taste test. Someone has been trying to snatch all the chips here. I'm gonna go for a chip as well. Wow. Mm. Ooh, so nice and creamy. Mm. Mm. Wow. Happily. So good. Very nice. Mm. Mm. Delicious. I'm so glad we have like a triple batch of this. Mm. I'm definitely gonna be eating eating this mm. on grilled potatoes later this week. I love vegan ranch dip on grilled potatoes. 
Guys, thank you so much for watching this video on how I make a vegan ranch dip. If you guys like this video and you want to see more recipes like this one, just make sure you hit that like and subscribe button below.